we're always trying to come back to that idea of finding the student's strength and how will the strength enable a student to overcome the deficit. We are a small school and our commitment is to knowing each student individually. And I'll give you an example of something that happened earlier in this year. We had a student uh, for whom um, maintaining focus in the classroom was really difficult. Uh, the student also very competitive. Mm -hmm. And always, you know, you could tell that they wanted to be on top. So what we did was we um, talked with the student about what are the concerns your teachers have. The student started to recognize his behavior and he, he made adjustments rather quickly because at the end of the period he wanted to say, I did not have to have a teacher repeatedly ask me to take out my pencil. I did not have a teacher to ask me repeatedly, you know, don't distract my neighbor. And that's working with the student, and the student is very proud of, of himself, and it's something that works, but that's knowing the student as an individual. His strength is actually he wants to be a very good and strong student. That was a window into how he could improve his behavior, and it worked. Generally, within a month of a child being here, I'll get an email or a call from a parent saying, my child loves going to school now. Thank you very much. Right. And making sure that we replicate that experience for any potential family and student is important to us. That school is a place of success for their child and not just another school environment. Mm -hmm.